move this so we can get a little bit angle here. Which one am I missing? And this is the very first one that I ever got to. Ah, oh, there we go. I'm missing a star me. I'm missing a Jolteon. I'm missing a Kabutops. I'm totally missing a Kabutops. And uh, Dragonite. I'm missing a Dragonite. I I don't. Uh, I I've seen one, but I don't have one. And I've got Mew 2 and Mew. But yeah, I'm, I've seen, but I don't have a Jolteon. You can see right there. And I've seen, but I don't have a Star Me. But I do have a Star You. So it's. Uh, I actually do have a missing no. On this one of my friends traded it to me so fifty five well let me see if I even have it uh, let me see um, my Pokemon right now is the amazing Kretzky <laughs> you can okay here's my po my Pokemans let me show you them Okay, let me see if I can show you this. Uh, okay. Yeah, I have the amazing Kretzky here. He's level 46. We have... Son of a bitch. He was... Uh, I named him... Yeah. Uh, I named him that because I was getting... Well, here... I was going through the uh, the one tunnel, and he was just being a little son of a bitch, and just kept on hurting me, you know, attacking me. So I finally caught him, and I called him son of a bitch. So yeah, my Gengar. Um, I've got a Magmar, just simply named Magmar, Rhinos. This is Rhinos. Um, well, hey, if the name fits, right? We got, uh, you'll like this one. This is Raichu. R Y E dash C H E W. Would you kindly make your Thanksgivings showy? <laughs> And then, uh, and then I have Firebird, and that's my Firebird. When you get Pokemon, you're gonna <laughs> you're gonna name them after people in Channel Awesome. So yeah, I've got a lot of uh, yeah. So you know what? I'm going to make this offer at MAGFest. I want to see if I can finish my Pokemon Red. So if you guys have Pokemons for the Game Boy that I do not have, I will gladly trade them. And I will bring my... Uh, I will bring my... Oh, look at that. My hair stuck up there. And I will bring a, uh, a Game Boy... And we can, we can trade them. So, you shouldn't be allowed to name. I know, I know. I, I really shouldn't. <laughs> oh, you you do, but you don't think you can make it to the con. Oh, now I go. I do have a link cable. I think. I'm sorry. Now, now I go. Where you where you, you in Georgia? I think I remember you stating.
You should do a review of Good Eats under the title that you can watch this. In South Georgia. About where? I used to live in uh, Tallahassee, and uh, I used to drive up to, I used to work at uh, WCTV. I don't know if you know WCTV, but uh, I used to uh, drive up there for a work, because that's where I worked. Valdosta. Valdosta. I don't, I don't know Val, I don't know if I know Valdosta. Amazing segment, going to make some Japanese curry. Ooh, yum. Oh, the, the, there, there are some pretty girls in Tallahassee, I tell you what. Superhero Samurai Cyber Squad. We're going through all the Disney ones first. We're going through all the Disney ones first, so. But, yeah, we might just do Superhero Samurai Cyber Squad. Do I know Lake Park? I think I know Lake. Think I know Lake Park. Park. I think I know Lake Park. Angry Joe lives in your hometown. Oh really? It's crazy to drive. A lot of places in Tallahassee are kind of crazy to drive. <laughs> Darkwing Duck should be coming soon. TMNT and Danger Mouse were just because I wanted to. So. Two-part episode with both Bill Nye and the Science Guy and Good Eats. Swift the Fox, it'd be, it'd be tough. I don't know a whole lot of science myself, so I don't know how I would uh, review it, but we'll see, we'll see. Yeah, and I've got uh, I've got GI Joe coming up here next year for the thing. So, Tuscan actually did a uh, stuck in your head with Danger Mouse, and yes, I love Danger Mouse. He's terrific. He's magnific. He's the greatest secret agent in the world. Danger Mouse, powerhouse. <laughs> he's the quickest, he's the strongest, he's the best. Yeah, it actually was, Tuscan. Uh, it was shown on... I want to say it was shown on Nickelodeon a long time ago. It was actually really good. It was really good. <laughs> I don't need another song stuck in my head. Please stop. With Dr. Insano, best review ever. Well, you know, I do have, uh, I do have Noah coming out to, uh, to help me with, um, a review, or well, not with a review, but with the movie, so, uh, maybe, maybe I can talk him into it. Tir Nanok. Is it, is it pronounced that thick, Tir Nanok? Shade up for the full I'm I'm sorry, I'm not sure. Tirnano. Tirnano. Okay. I love other languages. It's just Bring your hand and say no app, but don't ask why. <laughs> hopefully, Johnny. Uh hopefully. Uh we didn't have him in because uh in uh, some of the others because uh, he's just been so very very busy he's been really busy so uh, I just have been kind of uh, you know let him do his own stuff No flame is stealing your shoes. 
Yeah. Well, and I'm excited. Um, Noah is actually going to be coming out to uh, help film in uh, January. So very excited. Very excited for that. Um, it's going to be great. Yeah, I'm, I'm very excited for the whole thing. So, yeah. He's still doing okay, as far as I know. Um, as far as I know, everything's going well. Uh, he's still going to be doing. He's still doing videos and stuff. So yeah. Ah, oh, that's cool. Oh, uh, Jessica, that's that's a cool outfit. Have you seen? Uh, Oh goodness. Oh gosh. That looks gorgeous. Oh, junk boy. Oh, Cog oh wow. That looks really good. Oh, Kago sent me that. Okay. Wow, that looks really really good. Do not feed him Timbits. Do Timbits and uh and Spoonie not go together well? That's that's awesome. That looked really really good. Whatever happened to the Famicom Gunblade? Seafara, it's actually right over there. Um, I've I've still got it, and, and everything is groovy. Uh, let me show you. You know what? No, I'm not going to show you. I'm not going to show you. Because I want those people who haven't seen it to be surprised when they see it in the show. Don't feed Spoonie after midnight. Okay, there you go. Oh, see, fair. Okay, yeah. Yeah, we did have trouble. But it fin we finally did get him. Uh, we finally did get it. And uh, everything's, everything's groovy. Slow down. You move too fast. You got to make the morning last just Kicking down the cobblestones Looking for fun and feeling groovy Na 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 Feeling groovy Mario Advan Advent Calendar No, I didn't see that Ian Hart shut up <laughs> He loves Tim Hortons well, I got to tell you, the strawberry vanilla cream filled, the, the strawberry filled cream, uh, vanilla cream donuts, those are my favorites. Oh my God. Yay, he's having a Garfunkel or a Harper's Bazaar. Bring the Famicom Blade to Magfest? I don't know, maybe. Maybe. And yes, I have been watching Phantom Blood. I've uh, there's a site that's been translating them as soon as they possibly can to to get them out. And yeah, so I've been uh, doing that. Yay, Emily! Yay, Emily! Oh, we've been missing you. Anthony has been saying such wonderful things about you. He's been saying what a wonderful wife you are, and how sweet and kind you are to him. And uh, just he's just been gushing about you on here. It's just been fantastic. You can scroll up and see all of the. Oh well, if you got on, then you probably wouldn't. But but it's true. It's ab every last word is true. That he's just been, um, that he loves your cooking and that he loves you and just. <laughs> <laughs> Rabid lemur. I will today. <laughs> I will later on today. Um, I'm going to send you script number one. So we'll we'll start with that. Or actually uh, with script uh, number two, which is actually script number three. But stuff that I can't go on 
on the stream about. But yes, well, I'll, I'll have a script for you. So. <laughs> Could eat episode. Oh, yeah. You have to dress up like Alton Brown. Well, and I've got, he's got a receding hairline, and I don't have a receding hairline. I just have very high peaks. Uh, the, the sides, the whole family has this. Um, all the men in my family, at least. Um, it's all just up there, but yeah, so. Miss Nye Young, oh. Wow. Okay, guys. I, I'm just going to... Mm. Oh, it's coming. It, the kitty is coming, but uh, I just got to... Just got to appreciate this. Just got to appreciate this a little bit. Wow, she is she is beautiful. <laughs> yeah, she is. Well, and and I'm actually even. Uh, I hope she sends me an email because uh, we're trying to. Uh, you know, I want I have a role for her that I would love for her to play, but. Um, hey, take care, Louis three thanks for coming in i hope you had a good time and uh i hope we see you again and thank you very much for watching my videos and liking what i do noiko i love maru love maru yes maru is so cute Well, hopefully she, like I said, hopefully uh, she, um, Hi, whoa, didn't know, forgot it was a video. Um, hopefully she'll get in touch with me very quickly. So, because I'd love for her, I've got a, a role I'd love for her to do, but. Um, milk chocolate advent calendar. Oh my gosh, I want that. Ardoin, I want that. Ah. Oh. That looks so good, and that would be so much fun. I know she's around, but uh, I told her to uh, send me an email, and she just hasn't sent me an email yet. And I'm, uh, I'm a little worried that uh, you know she's going to be either too busy or she's just not going to be able to uh, be part of it. So. Oh no, Blazing Skies, you're allergic to chocolate. Oh, I hate to hear that. Oh, what a sweetie heart. Look at a little kitty. He's asleep on a pillow, on a blue blanket. What a sweetie heart. That's beautiful. <laughs> Lily. Lily is her name. She's a sweetie. She's just a little sweetie. <laughs> Maybe things will work out. I hope so. Gaki no Tsukai Batsu. Oh, look. Oh, gosh. Louis. Okay. If you can, let me know where you're watching it. Because I, I have to. I, I love. I love downtown. I love downtown. They're, they're my favorite Manzai group. So send me a link or shoot me an email uh, shoot me an email and tell me where the where you're going to be watching it and, and if if there's a possibility that I can watch it even though I'm here in America <laughs> oh poor little kitty
Dracoric, allergic to cats. Dracoric, I am too. I know uh, people are pretty probably going to be pretty surprised about that, but yeah, I'm allergic to cats too. Very much so, actually. And uh, so, yeah, it's, it's kind of hard for me to have, uh, especially a long hair cat like that. That's a beautiful cat. But I would just be miserable. That's a beautiful cat, Seafara. Apples are tough. Wow, that's got to be really tough. I'm also allergic to poultry. Um, not by being around them, but by eating them. I, I, I can't... Well, I can, but that's a long story. But I'm allergic to, uh, to chicken, to turkey, to duck, to... But I'm not allergic to eggs, which is very, very odd. Yeah, it's a rare allergy. Actually, I've only met two other people who have my allergy. But um, I can, uh, I'm okay as long. Now, see, that's the thing, Blue Bomber. Uh, I'm allergic to eating chicken. I can hold a chicken. That's fine. It's just eating the chicken that I'm allergic to. Um, now, one of my friends uh, in Tallahassee actually told me that um, it was probably just a histamine problem and to take some Benadryl for it. So I've been taking uh, children's Benadryl and... Uh, okay. Story time. Everybody sit down because this is going to take a, a few minutes. <laughs> um, I've been allergic to poultry all my life. Um, I always complained that when I ate chicken when I was a little boy that I'd get a fat lip. Well, one day it, it hit me so bad in second grade that um, second or third grade that I almost passed out because I couldn't breathe very well. So it sucks. So I've had to be careful and, and really pay attention to ingredients and things like that. Okay. So I went at, when I went to Tallahassee, there was a barbecue place, a barbecue place just on the other side of Georgia, uh, just like half a mile from the border of Georgia and, uh, and Florida. And uh, I couldn't eat any of the barbecue, and I told one of my friends, well, he he's a nurse for the Army Reserve, or at least he was. And he said, you know, it just sounds like a histamine problem. Have you tried taking Benadryl for it? And I'm like, no, I was thinking of taking shots for it. And he's like, no, no, no. Your stomach has a lining that prevents that kind of medicine from getting into it and that's where you need it so he said get some children's Benadryl take half a dose eat some chicken then take the other dose drink carbonated sodas or carbonated drinks to get the oils down into your stomach uh, wipe your lips to make sure that there's no oils on your mouth and just see how that works and it worked and I didn't feel any effects so I kept on doing it and I kept on doing it and uh, now I can eat chicken and turkey and all that stuff but I have to take children's Benadryl or have it with me and uh, and just eat other things I have to stay kinda cool I can't be too hot um, I have to uh, yeah I have to stay cool I have I can't uh, I have to eat other types of foods to keep the uh, the oils down um, I drink carbonated sodas and I'm fine so yeah that's how I can uh, still have chicken and turkey on the holidays as long as I have my children's Benadryl and it's got to be the children's Benadryl um, because it has a little bit more medicine in it because kids they're born without any immunities so they always get shots and stuff so the children's Benadryl actually has a bit more medicine in it uh, as far as I understand I could be totally wrong but that's how I understood it and uh, yeah so that's 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 what I do 
That's what they said, said now, Eko. Um, he said that you'd take the children's Benadryl because it's got a little bit more medicine in it. And I get the liquid. Um, there was one time that I got, that I only had the tablets. And I had to chew the tablets and practically rub the, uh, the powder on my gums like I'm some coke fiend or something. Just to try and get it into my system really quick. It was actually my honeymoon. Uh, it was really bad. I had a turkey leg at uh, Disney. It was hot. We only had water. But I really wanted that turkey leg. And, uh, yeah, it was really bad. It was really bad. And uh, on the bus back, I was swelled up like a Stay Puft Marshmallow Man. And uh, all they had down in the uh, hotel lobby was the uh, the packet of Benadryl. So I was, so I took one and I was chewing it up. I was trying to crush the other one in a makeshift mortar and pestle, and just trying to get the, the Benadryl into my system as quick as I could. Oh, it was horrible. Sat in a bath, and I was, I, I was, yeah, it was bad. It was awful. Awful, awful. Makes you swell up. Yeah. And see, and that's... It's hard for me to wear jewelry. Because if I have an attack, I'll swell up. Do we have a cooking mama impression? But... Why would I do a cooking mama impression? <laughs> Your husband is allergic to peanuts. Yeah, yeah. If you put something on your gums, or if you uh, put something underneath your tongue, it gets into your system very quickly. So if you, uh, so whenever I do take the Benadryl, if any of you guys even want to, you know, try that if you've got a similar allergy or something, um, put it. And you need to take medicine like right now. Uh, when you take the shot. Keep it a little bit underneath your tongue, and put a, and make sure that you swish a little un, uh, near your gums. Kind of like that, because that's why people chew, because they they put the tobacco in there, and it gets into their system a lot faster because it's next to their gums. Now we've learned something today, haven't we? <laughs> hey, take care, Nagato. No worries. Take care. Um, so yeah. So that's why people chew. Because the tobacco gets in there very quickly. Um, so that's why we put Benadryl or medicine underneath our tongue and underneath and next to our gums. So there you go. Yeah. It's more absorbent. So there you go. So yeah. So if you ever need an, uh, to take some medicine and you need it to get into your system very quickly, shoot, you know, instead of just shooting it and having it go all the way down, shoot it and put some into your gums and underneath your tongue. And it'll go in there faster. Are children good for the diet? Um, well, it's kept me young for these 145 years that I've been around. But then again, maybe I've said too much. I'm just kidding. <laughs> That's what you get for being a nursing major. There you go. That the gums are more absorbent. There you go. There, I did not know that. Benadryl never did it for you, Christy. What works for you? What uh, what medicines work for you for that? Ma uh, Madoka and Magica. I don't think I've ever... Madoka and Magica. I don't think I've... I've uh, I know that one. Uh, I do know Madoka Box, 